fly or the pilot on the planet. Today we will share how we set our GPS to fly competition from start to goal. Once you know how to create it, uh, you can organize all, the, all yourself. Let's, Let's check, check it, it out. out. When we set the GPS, it will be easy to create from three different situations. General flight, start and final glide. Yes, I do the same. So Seiko, what are for you the general setting for competition? On my GPS for general info, there are value, glide rate, ground speed, altitude, altitude above ground, wind force and direction. Distance to the next turn point. Almost same for me. I also put altitude to next turn point for some special situation. That's right. So let me see your GPS. In the bottom on left part of the screen, I have my basic information with altitude, ground speed, vario and glide. On the left side, I have wind and compass information. What about your start settings, Charles? Main important is to be on time at the start cylinder. So, I need to check distance to the start cylinder, time, start time, time to the start cylinder. In the top left corner, I set details for the start with time to go on time at the start. I design in green the information to reach the next turn point. Required glide, distance to the next turn point, altitude arrival to the turn point, and altitude above ground just beside following by the battery level the clock. So for the final glide setting? I use some more information to reach the goal. Distance to the goal, altitude to goal, and glide ratio. All information in red are those I need for the final glide. But don't forget to cross the line. <laughs> <laughs> Many GPS have possibility to customize the screen. Make a comfortable setting, so you can concentrate on the weather, the feeling, the handling, and the pilot around. 